morning, we're gonna actually go on the Rio Celeste hike, take a hike to the most beautiful waterfall in Costa Rica. Continuing our Costa Rica adventures, we stopped by the Avatar tree on the way to Rio Celeste, which is supposedly the inspiration for the tree used in the Avatar movie. As I told you, my friend, the first stop that we're gonna do today gonna be in a waterfall. This type of viper can kill you in 25 minutes. We were blown away by the majesty of the Rio Celeste waterfall. Seeing the bright blue water of the river was unreal. Now we're headed to the Blue Lake. Apparently it's really beautiful up too. As we kept exploring the rainforest around the Rio Celeste, we came upon the place where the two rivers collide and you can see the distinctly different colors of the rivers, one clear and the other blue. Since swimming was not allowed near the waterfall, our guide took us to a spot where we could get in and take in the blue turquoise water of the Rio Celeste. The trip to Rio Celeste waterfall was absolutely amazing. It was so wonderful to see the beautiful trees and to see the pit viper. The pit viper is a small snake that can kill you in 25 minutes. It was crazy to see that small of a snake that could pack that much venom that would be lethal to a human in 25 minutes. And then to see the blue optical phenomenon of the waterfall because the waterfall looks like it creates blue water, but it's not. It's because the two rivers that collide actually have opposite pH balance and the other minerals that are in the water creates this blue optical illusion. And so it was so amazing. All the views, oh gosh, we were just blown away. It was a lot of work though, I will have to say that. And it started to rain off and on, which is just part of going to the rainforest. They don't call it a rainforest for no reason. <laughs> this morning, we actually will go to El Salto to do a personal yoga session. And El Salto itself has a waterfall. And then after that, we're gonna check out the mystical hanging bridges. Been so excited to see those. After a quick breakfast in La Fortuna, we met up with our yoga instructor in El Salto, and it was an enjoyable experience to be listening to the sounds of nature while performing yoga was very memorable. We actually are outside of the hanging bridges right now, about to go inside. Views look gorgeous already from the outside, so I know it's going to be very pretty on the bridges. The leaf colored ants are everywhere. Some hard working ants. 
walking over the hanging bridges while observing the tropical plants and bird life of this nature reserve was one of my favorite things that we did in Costa Rica. The views from these suspended walkways were mind blowing. Some of those bridges are pretty intimidating. They're about as high or higher than most trees. Taking a little side trail to the waterfall down here. I'll check this out. You got sea legs? No. But Actually, I, did, I thought it was like walking in another world. Like it was mystical. Yeah, it was like Avatar. Since Costa Rica has tons of volcanoes, there are thermal hot springs all around. And we checked out one of the most popular ones, Baldy Hot Springs. They organize their thermal water pools based on the water temperature, with the hottest pools being at the top of the hot springs. We spent most of our time lounging around the hot spring pools and eating at the Baldy Buffet restaurant. Food at the Baldy Hot Spring is pretty good. It's a buffet style, but pretty good food. I'm enjoying the chicken and the rice and beans. Just more traditional Costa Rican food, but then they had some other selections as well. One of the last activities we did was a cooking and dancing class. It was pretty cool to learn how to make homemade tortillas, and the dancing part really got me out of my comfort zone. So what are you doing right now, Cassandra? We already made our cocktails. I got one. <laughs> So the rice comes for percentages. So the rice doesn't have a name like basmati or jasmine. Um, we select the rice. I cooked this chicken. Master chef over here. Let's see what you got. Let's see what you got. Yeah. Now we're serving ourselves food we just made. Finished process right here. Sadly, our adventures in Costa Rica are coming to an end today, but we had a great time, an awesome time enjoying all the waterfalls, the lush landscapes, the mountains, the volcanoes. Costa Rica has everything to offer. So many adventures, so much hiking, just everything was just beautiful. The people were so amazing, so welcoming. Can't wait to get back to this country. Although we will miss Costa Rica, we have many more adventures coming soon to this channel.